An investigation is now underway after two workers were found dead inside this truck at a high school track field in southwest Houston. We've been following this story since our newscast at midday. It happened at Wisdom High School on Beverly Hill near Hillcroft. Our Brittany Jeffers is live there right now with what firefighters had to say about this. Brittany? Yeah, Bill, a very tragic case out here today. As you mentioned, uh, firefighters were out here for several hours. They just left around 5 o'clock this, uh, this evening. But I'm told that this was a very significant operation, they say, for the hazmat crews today. It was here on the grass surrounding the track at Wisdom High School where three men went to work this morning. But tragedy hit when they inhaled some kind of chemical used in fertilizer. The concentration it was at, it's extremely dangerous. If you're within a few feet of the opening, you can easily become um, overwhelmed by the fumes, and it appears that's what may have happened here. According to HFD, the three were contracted to spray the field with fertilizer, but when the first went to open the barrel of the truck, the fumes from the chemicals overpowered him, and he tumbled into the tank. A second colleague tried to help, but he also collapsed, and the third then called for help, but it was too late. According to HFD Hazmat, they believe the chemical was called organophosphate. They then conducted an air quality check before crews could safely begin the recovery phase. The confined space coupled with the heat and chemicals presented several challenges. It's still a very dangerous environment. Uh, they had to get dressed in special suits and breathing equipment and go into an enclosed environment with noxious fumes. At this point, HISD police don't know if the men were wearing masks and say that this appears to be a terrible accident. OSHA will investigate to see if there were any violations, and HISD has offered a statement about the two subcontracted workers, adding, quote, our thoughts and deepest sympathies go out to their families and friends. A difficult day for many people involved, and we are told by HISD police that the medical examiner's office will release the identity of the victims once their family members are all notified. We're live here in southwest Houston. I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC Channel 2 News. Brittany, thank you, ma'am.